Um, what I do in the band is play keyboards, musically speaking, and then uh, non-musically. Well, we all pitch in, and everyone tries to do their part. But um, I do the music for the intro, for the open of the show when we go on, when we play live. I, I wrote a piece that, they, that we come out to, and um, just do uh, do what I can to further the the sway of brand. My day job is writing music to picture, so I score films, do music for commercials, and write music for TV stuff. So, um, well, it, it relates to Suede in that being able to play in a band with Suede is like the opposite of being in the studio all day and writing music and doing all that stuff. It's just a blast to, to get to go out and, and play great music with my friends, you know? So, in a lot of ways, it's the antithesis of what I do in the studio, but it's also related because of music and I just basically do music all the time. So, it's just another extension of uh, my musical life. Well, I started out in TSOL, that was back in the dark ages, and I still play with them. But um, along the way, I played with uh, Bob Dylan, Berlin, The Church, Ian Astorberg from The Cult, and a bunch of other people I'm forgetting right at the moment. But, um, but yeah, I've been around and, and played in a bunch of different bands. Davey and I met on the Warp Tour. We were doing some TSOL shows on the West Coast, and B. Union was on the, that same tour. And, my friend Bobby Sepulveda but I said, "You got to see this band. This is a great band called Beat Union. You got to check them out." And I think we were in uh, Sacramento, or somewhere, or somewhere up northern California. And I was just blown away. I really, really enjoyed them, and thought Davey was a great, great front man, first of all, but um, even more importantly, a really nice guy. They were, they were all really cool people, really down to earth, and. We got to, got to be friends a little bit, and um, I, I'm in this other band called the Black Diamond Riders, and we did a recording over at Hurley, and David came to see us play, and um, we just kind of got to know each other, you know, over time, just, you know, playing in different bands and kind of being around this, this scene, so uh, he asked me to come play with Swedehead a year and a few months ago. It's, it's just a f really great fun band to be in, you know, I think when, when I was a younger musician I worried a lot about a lot of stuff that I don't worry about anymore, and um, it's just a blast to just go out and play without an agenda, like, you know, I mean, it's, it's just fun, just let's see what happens, let's go out and have fun and make sure that we're having a good time first and foremost, and that we like what we're doing, and that we're all like each other, you know, and those things are all happening in Swayhead, so it's, that's, that's a neat thing to have happen, it's unusual for bands, and I don't take it for granted because I've been around the block a few times, so it really is great to play as a band that's all friends, we all love the music, we really enjoy playing, and there's no, there's, there's just no hidden agendas, everyone's having a blast, and we're just taking it as it comes, so that, that's a fun thing to have happen in a band.